Today, we're going into the Knife Maker's Workout. Be sure to stay until the end of the video because I'm sure you'll learn something new. My name is Jack Bailing, CEO and founder of Shed Knives. And like I said today, we're going into the Knife Maker's Workout, what it is, how to do it, and why I do the Knife Maker's Workout. So let's get into it. What is the Knife Maker's Workout? Basically, it's a workout designed to enhance your knife making skills, or at least to get you warmed up to do a physical activity. The Knife Maker's Workout is a five step workout, 20 reps a piece, so you'll accomplish 100 reps by the end of your workout. It's pretty simple, there's not much to it. You can do it all with your own body weight as you see, and it's just something I've been doing for several months now before I get into the shop because it gets me ready, gets me in the right mindset, gets me ready to go. Now, why do the Knife Maker's Workout? Well, like I said, it's to get warmed up, but it's also to set the standard for other knife makers. This is nothing where you gotta diet, you gotta change your entire routine. This is none of that. This is just something to do in the morning or whenever you're doing your knife making. For me, I start in the morning, so I do my knife maker's workout before I get into the shop. Yeah, so fitness is very important for a ton of different reasons, but let's get into the workout. Alrighty, so first off, we're gonna start with windmills. This is a great exercise because it's gonna work our core. It's also gonna stretch our back muscles, gonna stretch the inner thigh muscles as well. So this is a nice workout to just warm up with and it just gets the motion going. So 20 reps for every exercise. If you do mess one up, mess up a rep, just do a clean one. It's just like my knives. If I mess one up, I have to do it right. So I have to do another one. And same thing goes for the reps. Which brings me to shedknives.com. If you like knives, like you see on the right here, I highly encourage you to check out shedknives.com at the link in the description. Next, we're moving on to jumping jacks. This is pretty simple. Just jump, spread your feet, open your arms. Uh, pretty simple exercise here. Once again, 20 of these and uh, just get some motion going. So you see how I'm applauding throughout each exercise. This is really good if you have a group of people. You can certainly do it when you're by yourself, but if you have a group, it's great because then everybody kind of applauds each other and gets them motivated. Uh, now we're doing air squats here. Just picture you're sitting on a chair and standing up while holding a basketball or a soccer ball. Just it's a good visualization there. This works your legs and it keeps your hands and everything uh, just centered. So a little structure there. So this is really good. Once again, another applaud there. Just get the group going. Now we're going to move on to sit-ups. This works, once again, really good if you have a partner, but I don't here, so I'm just going to stick my legs straight out, or at least as far out as I can, to give a little counterweight there. So that's why you see the legs moving, just it's a counterweight. This obviously is going to work your core. If you keep your hands behind your head, it's going to be tougher, where you can keep them in front of your chest if you want it to do a little easier. But once again, having somebody hold your feet is also helpful. A little buddy system there. And then we want to start thinking about our next workout here. So we're already 80% of the way through. 20% left, which is going to be our push-ups. Really, the longest portion of this is the squats and the sit-ups. So there we go. We're all done. Brush yourself off. Give a little applause for the group. And now we're going to move on to some push-ups. All right. Now watch the back here. Look how straight everything is from the front of my face, neck, back, legs. Everything 
lines up okay so we want to do 20 clean push-ups you can work a few different types of push-ups but uh, just 20 get them done and you're done with the knife makers workout if you enjoyed this video go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you know someone who might like this video as well hit the share and thank you all for watching